Hey guys, and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. My name is The Lady Designer, and in this video, we will go over a few screenshots that are revealed so far by Planet Zoo for the Grasslands Animal Pack that is coming to us on the 13th of December, so Tuesday next week already. Now, if you're interested in getting the Grasslands Animal Pack, then please do make sure to check out our sponsor of the channel, Instant Gaming, because they offer a really great discount on many of our most favorite games, including, of course, Planet Zoo and the Grasslands Animal Pack, and of course, all the other Planet Zoo packs, but also other games like The Sims, City Sky. Skylines, Farming Simulator, Jurassic World Evolution, Prehistoric Kingdom, and so many other great games. And by buying via the website, you will get a great discount and you will also be supporting the channel. I will make sure to put a link to their website in the description of this video and in the pinned message of the comment section so you can easily find it. So now, this is the screenshot of the striped hyena and for what I can tell is that not everyone is very excited about the looks of this animal. Now, I find the fur and stuff looking absolutely amazing, but I did see some screenshots passing by of a real striped hyena and noticing like a few differences like in the head and also maybe, but, but it could be like just the weird or, or the wrong angle of this animal and it maybe looks a lot better in the game. But yeah, it feels like they are standing a, like a bit taller on their, their paws and then like their their neck is like a lit, little bit higher as well so I could see where people are coming from now I am no expert on these animals I don't know much about these animals so I'm just talking about the things that I've read but yeah I, I feel like they definitely just looked at the spotted hyena and took a lot from that and adjusted it but uh, I, I think maybe it needs a, more, a bit more adjustment but other that like the fur and stuff look absolutely amazing so yeah just to clarify i definitely don't think the hyena looks bad i think it looks definitely very pretty but i do understand where some people are coming from that they may find the animal not super accurate like comparing to real life but obviously just do let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about the striped hyena and uh, i'm just super curious to see more of this animal to see how it looks in game like as i said it can look a lot different in game sometimes than when you see just one screenshot from one different angle so uh, yeah I'm just in general curious to see more about this animal and uh, let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about the striped hyena screenshot that we've seen so far next up is the rednecked wallaby did you guess that a rednecked wallaby was grazing through the grass we're surprised it didn't eat at all over 90% of the rednecked wallabies diet is grass after after all. Now, I was actually really surprised when I looked up the size of this wallaby because they are actually super tiny. Like, they become, or like adults become around 80 to like 100 centimeters in height. So that is actually not that tall. And I was really surprised about that. I didn't know that. And I was just looking at like the uh, kangaroo that we have in the Australia pack. And I think these guys are definitely a lot smaller. And uh, they also probably have like pouches just like the other kangaroos. So that is going to be cute to see how that is going to look in the game when they are getting some offspring. Uh, other than that, I think uh, as far as I can tell with my knowledge of a red necked wallaby, which is not that much. I think this one looks really cute. I really do like the fur and stuff. I think they really did a great job on creating this animal. So yeah, I look forward to seeing this animal in the Grasslands Animal Pack soon. So then the last screenshot of today is from the Caracal. Caracals tend to live in either grasslands or rocky hills, so it's not too unusual to see them lying down in a sunny patch of grass. Now we did see a video of the Caracal this afternoon. And I actually feel like they are a little bit 
thinner. Maybe also they have a pretty long body, but I don't know. I feel like this picture again might not resemble how they actually look if you see them moving around in the game. I do really like these uh, tufts here on the ears. That looks really cute. I remember with, I think it was the Binturong that it looked a bit odd. So this is definitely <laughs> looking a lot better than back in the days with the Binturong. I'm also super curious about the kittens of the Caracol. I mean, the real life kittens look absolutely adorable with these cute little tufts on the on the ears as well. So uh, yeah, I uh, I definitely look forward to see this animal as well in action. And other than that, it, it just looks like a very beautiful animal. But yeah, of course, do let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the Caracol. And of course, let me know what you all think of the screenshots that we have seen so far for these three animals coming to us with the Grasslands Animal Pack on the 13th of December. Let me know in the comments down below. Leave a like at the video if you guys enjoyed and subscribe of course if you haven't already. And yeah, I just really do hope to see you guys all in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye guys!